like to get talk more about Singletary, but the logistics of Christian Wade. I know a couple people were talking yeah. about this. They're they're questioning the eleventh man, the ninety first player, yeah, and all yeah, sorts yeah. of stuff. So if you could bestow upon hashtag nation your unique talent, and okay. I'm, not, I'm not talking about singing Backstreet Boys. What I'm saying is that dun, 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 dun. Christian Wade's uh, if he's on the roster, he's not on the roster. How does this situation play out from a technicality contract standpoint? Okay. and ride with us on YouTube and don't forget to check out live play-by-play of the Bills season coming up on Sportscaster. Okay, um, so I saw somebody in one of the Bills groups say that he's not eligible to make the roster because he's not a U.S. citizen and it's a work issue, which is completely not true at all. He's got a, he's work eligible. He's, got a work he's visa, getting paid yeah. right now. Like yeah. he's, I don't understand what the concern is. Yeah, so being part of that program, it leaves you in one of three possible scenarios. So there's actually three scenarios here at play. So, Mar, I'm gonna I'm gonna walk you through a few of them, right? So, yeah. scenario one is right now he's roster exempt from the 90 man roster. So that means he's the 91st player on the roster. Yes. So they don't have to count him towards the 90 man, but he's allowed to play. Okay. Kay. He didn't see him play till late. Yes. Right? yes. Okay. Which was totally. Expected. And the Colts third and fourth team. We're not talking about the 2000 Ravens here. Right. Okay. Yeah. Exactly. So, you know, they got him some looks in the game. Yeah. Right. He was fast too. He pulled away. He was the second. Uh, I think Pro Football Focus had him ranked as the second fastest player in the preseason behind uh, the kid that ran that punt back from uh, from the Browns. Oh, yeah, that guy? Yeah. That's a great flew. story, by the way. It is a great story. All right, go ahead. Um, but he said he was the second fastest player. He pulled away from everybody. He did. Yeah. The stage um, didn't have a chance. So, um, right now he doesn't count towards the 90-man roster. He's roster exempt. But that goes away when they have to cut down to 53. Right, so long story short, he makes the team or he doesn't make the team. That's mm-hmm. the deal, yep. right? Yep. So if he makes the team on the 53-man roster, that brings forward two scenarios. So let's talk about the other. Let's say he doesn't make the team. Okay, doesn't make the team. Right. Then he could be your 11th practice squad guy. You don't have to worry about anybody touching him. Right. At he, all. Right. Exactly. He's not subject to waivers, so you don't have to waive him to put him on the practice squad. Yes. Uh, you only get 10 players on the practice squad, and you have to waive them in order to get them there. Right, okay. so they have to be subject. Yep. Every other team in the NFL could pick that player up and add them to their 53-man roster through waivers. Well, Christian Wade's not subject to that. Yes. If the Bills cut him, he could be placed immediately on the practice squad. But if he's on the practice squad as the 11th player, he's ineligible to be activated this entire season. Yeah. So he'll right. just develop the entire right. year. Right. Exactly. So that's scenario one. Scenario two is Christian Wade makes, makes the, the team. team. Right. If he makes the team. His roster exemption is gone. Yep. Okay? So if he makes the team, he's counting towards the 53 men, and he's on your team. Just like any NFL player. Just like player, any man. other NFL player. And right. what that means is that if he's, he's just like any NFL player, if the Bills at any time decide to cut him, he will go through waivers. Right. And all other teams will have a chance to pick him up. Right. And if they, they don't, and, he puts him, and the Bills put him on their practice squad, he's not the 11th man anymore. Right, He's exactly. one of the 10, right. and someone could just pluck him up and put him on their 53. Exactly, and that's scenario three, right? The Bills yes. put him on the roster, he's there for a week, they cut him, put him through waivers, um, he clears waivers, nobody touches him. Because again, in order to clear waivers, that player has to be added to a 53-man roster. Yes. You can't pick a guy up off of waivers and put him on your practice squad. That's not allowed. That's not allowed. Right. That's not allowed. You have to add him to your roster, and then you have to waive him to try and slide him into your practice squad. So that's how that works. You can't pick up a guy off of waivers and place him on your practice squad. That's not that, that's not possible. Now, any players who are on a practice squad can be signed at any time by any team mm-hmm. to be added to their 53-man roster. You can't sign a practice squad guy and put him on your practice squad. That's not allowed either. So, again, three scenarios. Wade is roster exempt for the entire season because he's been placed on the practice squad. He's your 11th guy, can never be activated. Option two is he makes the team. Easy. Option team. option three is he makes the team for a week or a few weeks, and then you wave him and try and slide him down to your practice squad. Again, any team can pick him up off of waivers. Any team can sign him when he's on the practice squad away from you. So he becomes an at-risk player at that point. I think um, because of the depth that you're able to get at the running back position, uh, you're, 
it's not benefiting you to have Wade. Right. You know, the, tra- the possibility of losing him when you could lose almost three running backs by the end of this year. Right. I'm, you have to kind of look at from a value perspective, right? Who do you value? Who, who carries more value to your team? Sonoris Perry, TJ Yeldon, Christian Wade. Which of those carries the most value to your team right now? Perry, Yeldon, or Wade? Right. Those, Perry. Out of those three. Perry. Why? Because of his versatility. Because he plays special teams, right? Yes. Okay, exactly. Now, here's the scenario, right? Perry and Wade are kind of in a similar circumstance, right? Mm-hmm. Except Perry isn't practice squad eligible. Yes. Nor is Yeldon. Yes. But Christian Wade is. Yes. Right. But that the little caveat of nobody could touch him. Mm-hmm. If he's on your practice squad. If you make yeah. him the roster-exempt practice squad player, nobody can even put their hands on him. Yeah, but the, here's here's the only problem with that scenario. He's only on a one-year deal. So next season, he's a free agent anyway. So why put him on your practice squad and have him... Develop? Be, and have him be there all season and develop if he's only on a one-year deal? Because then nobody sees him. Yeah, but, I mean, everybody saw him. They did. They <laughs> I mean, did. that's... I mean, he's a buck 75. So yeah. it's not like he's your he's gonna carry the ball twenty five times for you no. in a game. No. Um, and I and I understand. But Tim, that. Tim Ellington brought up put him put him back as a punt returner. I I think that's a reasonable thing to say and see. And but again, I think you being out. the eleventh man on a practice on the practice squad is the best case scenario for the future for Christian Wade. Yeah, but everyone just saw him in the first preseason game versus the Colts. If you put him on your practice squad, eleventh man, roster exempt the entire year. Yeah. And then you come in the next season. Do you think a lot of people will remember him? Bills fans well. Bills fans, exactly. You know, and, and his run, I mean, let's just call it what it is. The Bills down block left. He had to beat one guy. He had a Because the whole cut. defense sucked right in. He had a right great in. cut. He had to beat one guy. That was it. Just boom, gone. What I love more about the run was that he cut, he carried the ball high and tight. He was all, all like this. Uh, the handoff scared me a little bit. <laughs> handoff scared me a little bit because... Yeah, it was. He's like, oh, it's so little. <laughs> this is so little. <laughs> is this a Nerf ball? Thank yeah. You. The, the handoff scared me a little bit because okay. it was a little a yes. little fumbling. Yes. A little scary. Um, but that's something you could fix. The guy's an athlete. You'll be able to.